So this, this is like a question I have for sure that I'm curious about. Okay. What are then your favorite airports and why? So um, my, def my favorite airport was, is definitely Singapore. Um, oh. Singapore has been, been voted like best airport in the world um, like a number of uh, years running. Um, and it's absolutely incredible what they've done there. Um, they've really tried to make it a, uh, I can't even explain it. Um, it. It's just such a unique experience. They've got, what did I write down here? Um, so they've got, no, oh, their biggest thing that they just introduced was, it's called the Singapore uh, Changi, which is the name of the airport, the Jewel. If you look up Singapore Jewel, it's this giant indoor, basically like botanical garden slash rainforest slash shopping slash restaurants <laughs> slash mirror maze. Like it is, it's just so random, but incredible that it's, it's oh. I can't even explain it. So yeah, for those, uh, for those watching, here's a, here's a photo of it. Yeah. So that is a giant waterfall in the middle of this thing. And they built this at the airport to give passengers and not even passengers, like, you know, if you're in Singapore and you can just go to this thing, cause it's actually located outside of security. So anybody can go to it, okay. but because it's located right there at the airport, passengers wow. that have a long layover can go out of security, go check it out and then just go right back into security. Um, but they've got that. I know they've got like a butterfly garden at the airport. I think they have like a small movie theater and that's on top of all the shops and restaurants. Wait, so, so why did you leave the airport on your trip? You should have stayed in the airport. That sounds I fun. Have. I really could have. And if there was an airport, excuse me, if there's an airport to do it, Singapore is definitely the place. But when you look up the Marina Bay Sands Hotel, you'll see why I left. And Singapore, I've heard, is a great, is a great city all around. So when I do get back there eventually, um, I'll definitely be leaving the airport for a few days and not just a few hours. <laughs> um, but, uh, but not only that, like Singapore airport, you know, Oh, it's very this is that building. I've yes. seen this building. So I okay. was at the very, the very top of that at basically the, the, the round point up there is, is where the rooftop bar or one of the rooftop yeah. bars. I mean, you got, you got to go to that. I mean, if you're, uh, yeah, so You're basically on, here. on the, the left side where it rounds out, that's the bar. So I was basically up there enjoying my cocktail and, yep, yeah. hey, I was right there. <laughs> enjoying my cocktail, watching the sunset. And, you know, it was it was pretty incredible because you have a great view of the city. Yeah. And, um, uh, yeah, it was it was amazing. But you're but getting back to your point, um, hmm. they, you know, the. Singapore made they specifically made their airport like that so you didn't have to leave it so it would actually be enjoyable to have a layover there a long layover so mm. that's something I wish that airports here would do but I mean that I don't foresee that happening in in our lifetime at all I think they I think maybe some airports might be trying to kind of get a little bit towards that but that's yeah Singapore is on a whole nother level that it's mm. it's pretty incredible 